All right, in this video, I'm going to show you how to make a duotone. So a duotone, duo means two, it's just going to be two colors. So we have a regular full color photograph here, and we're going to change it to a duotone. It's very easy. What you want to do is go over here and make an adjustment layer. So I'm going to click right here, new fill or adjustment layer. You can also do it up here, layer, new adjustment layer, and you're going to choose gradient map and say OK. All right, so right now that's a monotone. It's just one color. So we want to change this gradient right here. So if you click on that, it will open up this uh, slider here and let you change colors. So right click on that second color that's white and change it to another color. All right, and now we have a duotone. It's a photograph made up of two different colors. We have magenta and purple. But I want to show you another way to do a duotone. The first way I showed you, I like to use it that way, especially if I'm doing something that's uh, digital, going to be like put on a website or presented digitally only. But if you're going to set something up for print, it's a whole different thing. You have to use spot colors. And if you remember from other things we went over, a spot color is something that's only used in printing. It's like a specific ink that is mixed up for a print job, okay? It's not like the colors that come out of your printer, the CMYK. All right, so the way you can do that is you take your color photograph, go to image, mode, and you see there's duotone there, but it doesn't let you select it yet. So you need to go to grayscale first, and then just say discard. And once you have a black and white photo, then you can go to image, mode, and then you can choose duotone. All right, and it'll give you, here we go, duotone is right here. It already comes with black. This color here probably, because we had it a black and white photo, this color here, when you first open yours, it'll probably be white. But you can go in here and click on this and choose any, any color you want to change the color. Now, this is more, this here is showing you how it's mixed. So you can change the whole look of it completely by changing that curve. That's just letting you, um, the printer know how much ink is going on to the picture. All right, so that's just a quick overview of two different ways that you can make a duotone in Photoshop.